guys, I'm out here at Reagan National Airport with the Air Force Reserve Hurricane Hunters. They're going to take us aboard and walk us through their airplane that they're taking into hurricanes. Now here we're with Major Chris Dyke. What have we got going on here? All right, so the plane looks just like it would if we were flying in any kind of hurricane or storm. The back here we usually use to carry people and parts mm -hmm. going from uh, one location to another. But then once we get set up, we're really conducting operations. And so these, these are the two weather stations that we work with. I have a load master that sits here that releases these drop sons out of the plane, collects vertical data on wind speed, direction, temperature, dew point, pressure, all the way from the aircraft, all the way down to the water. And you put them right in here? Absolutely. He gets that information, works it up, sends it over to the weather officer, meteorologist that sits here. And that's you. That's me. I look at it, compare it to the data the plane's collecting. We put, together, put it all together, package it up, send it to the hurricane center. So tell me about the biggest storm you were in. Hurricane Paloma, 120, 150 knot winds, pushing the water, unbelievable. Wow. All right, well, let's head up to the cockpit and chat with the pilot. We're here with the pilot, Lieutenant Nate Wardell. Nate, is it pretty scary flying into a hurricane? Um, it can be sometimes, but I would say that it's really more intense in the moment. Um, we're so focused on flying and just keeping the crew and the airplane safe that we don't really have much time to think about it until kind of afterwards where we can reflect on it. What's it like being in the eye of a hurricane? Um, it's pretty amazing. It goes from kind of complete chaos in the storm environment to just clear air and you know, just, it's amazing. Well, while these guys are out there doing their job, you need to do your job at home as well. Heading into hurricane season, make sure that you have a plan. From Reagan National Airport, I'm meteorologist Michaela Lucero, WUSA 9.